Hi, good morning, folks, and welcome to today's racing on this Monday, the start of a brand new week, the middle of October. It's the 17th, and it is just before half past seven. And uh, I've got to say what a wonderful day it was yesterday, um, not in terms of uh, all the results, but uh, because we had time to spend with our clocking the gallop uh, faithful down at Gravel. We had our horse running yesterday. It might not have run into the money, but certainly it was a very encouraging run. So just for a word for all the clock in the gallop followers. Um, yesterday is run by Miraculous Man. I think he finished about five lengths back. He was last turning for home in his second race. And the feedback was good that he's on the right track. So just bear that in mind when he comes out next time out. So it is racing today, moving the tracks from the turf to the poly track today. A tough day yesterday in terms of certain races, but um, uh, there was some money to be had by all in certain of the races yesterday. Let's hope that today is a little bit better for the Ghost Rider in his place accumulator, which I think he missed by one leg yesterday, and we'll run through the eight races carded today. So it is on the poly track. The official track condition is standard. And uh, let's have a look at the details. There was uh, no rain yesterday when I was there, but the last seven days have yielded seven and a half millimeters of rain down at Gravel. And Kanya Sakai is not riding today. Uh, he has got Stipe's permission to get off. Let's go to the first race, which runs at five to one. Eight races today on the poly track. Race one is a qualified maiden over 1,200 meters. And here, number one, Lord Edward is now the mount of Apprentice Klengua, who will claim four kilos riding number one, Lord Edward. Also note number three, Easy Roy Easy will race with the blinkers on. For the Ghost Riders tipping number seven, McCartney for Tony Riverland and Keegan DeMello to beat number six, Geronimo. Third goes to number eight, and Darby Zeta. And fourth to number nine, King's Spear. So seven, six, eight, and nine. Watch out for the visiting runner from the Robin Clarson yard, number five, Lady Shocklucht, uh, who runs in the first race uh, because this horse uh, has run on the poly before and hasn't done too badly. So uh, watch out for the five in the first race, which is the opening leg of the bipod. Race two starts off the place accumulated half past one. It's a maiden plate for three rolls and it's run over 1,700 metres. And here you could scratch number two, Wild Style. That is a non-runner. So race two, scratch number two. The selection is number three, Imaginable. Again, Keegan DeMello gets the nod here for Alison Wright. To beat term number one, Johnny's Hope. Third number six, Corsican. And fourth to number five, Paris Pike. Three, one, six, and five in race number two. On we move to the third race, the start of the pick six at five past two. It's a merit graded 66 handicap over 1700 meters. And in race three, scratches number seven, Miss Missouri. That is out. The tip here is for number 11. That is Fever, Dennis Bosch, and Muzieni teaming up. Fever is tipped to win race three. Ahead of number two, Kanisa and Lela. Third goes to number 10. Just having a look at that one. That is Raven Sword, and fourth to number eight, High Green. Eleven to ten and eight for bigger perms include numbers four, Lord Minva, and five, Osceola. Four and five to go in there. Race four runs at twenty to three. It's a merit rated seventy six handicap over fourteen hundred meters, and in the fourth race there are no changes to report. Here at number one, Winter with Joe is the top choice. For Malasela, Cacheri, and Peter Musket. Winter with Joe's tip to beat home number seven, Pewter Sky. Third, number four, Metallic Gold. And fourth, number three, Maximus. One, seven, four, and three. But it is a tough race. The maiden winner, number two, Global Dollar, deserves to go in, as does number six, Kimura. Then the toughest race on the card, according to the Ghost Rider, is race five. It jumps off at quarter past three. It's a merit rated 76 handicap, and it's over 1,400 meters. Ghost Rider believes this is a field race. Says go the field here, but his top four in the order four to win it. Gentleman's Way to beat home number one, Giam Batista, third to five, Cupid Song, and fourth to number six, Black White Dynamite. 
And on we move to the sixth race at 10 to 4. This is a Phillies and Mayor 60 at handicap over 1,200 metres. Moving on to race six in the sixth race, number seven, Snow Tune, or race with a compression mask. Top choice here is the Mark Dixon runner, number three, Shell Seeker. Keegan DeMello rides that to beat number one, Meteoric, the visitor. Third, number four, Birdwatcher. And fourth, number two, Flying the Star. And then on to race seven at 25 past four, a Phillies and Mare 78 handicap over 1,200 metres. Race seven, number one, Toto, no blinkers. No blinkers for number one, Toto, now with the Mike Miller yard. So that is the change in the seventh race. And here, number three, tipped to win it, star choice for the Frank Robinson yard. Second, number five, Corner Crusade. Third, number eight, Arctic Princess. And fourth, number four, Mvula Zana. Three, five, eight, four. Watch uh, number six as well. They boldly go from the Dean Canamere stable. And the eighth and last race of the day runs at five o'clock this evening on this Monday. It's the Phillies and Mayor 60 at Handicap. It's run over 1,200 metres. Here, number 10, Street Dancing is the scratching. Scratch number 10, Street Dancing. Number one, Morgan Le Fay races with a Cornell Connor. And this selection in the last is number five, Aisling, to beat number one, Morgan Le Fay. Third given to number eight, Gimme a Lullaby. And fourth to number six in Kalanzini. Five, one, eight, and six in the eighth and last of the day. That rounds up our selections for today. Next up, we'll show you the place accumulator numbers for the start of a brand new week. So we're back with the place accumulator. And remember, it is starting off in race two, seven legs. The full perm today is going to cost you 432 Rand, cost you 43 Rand 20 for 10%, and 86 Rand 40 for 20%. So here are the numbers starting off in race two. That's off at 130. Numbers one and three in the first leg Johnny's Hope and Imaginable by two and 11, Kanisa and Leila and Fever. Then one, four, and seven, Winter with Joe, Metallic Gold, and Pewter Sky. By one and four, GM Batista and Gentleman's Way. By one, three, and four, Meteoric, Shell Seeker, and Bird Watcher. Then three, five, and eight, Star Choice, Corner Crusade, and Arctic Princess. And the last leg, one and five, Morgan Le Fay and Aisling. Those are our PA numbers today, 432 Rand. It's our only bet that we're taking, and it'll cost you 43 Rand 20 for 10%. And the Ghost Rider is pretty positive that you'll be in the winner's queue today after a slightly disappointing performance yesterday. Now, if you want to personally subscribe to the Ghost Rider for his selections, and it's a more in depth discussion on racing in KwaZulu Natal, you can WhatsApp him now on 082-695-3545. Um, and uh, just before we go, I will bring you the uh, cost structure of this, just that you've got that in mind and where you can deposit your monies. But for more people uh, to come on board, there are quite a few people already on board, but if you want to come on board and find out more information about KwaZulu Natal racing, then this is the place to be. So I'm coming up with that shortly. So this is basically what it is. Um, it is 70 Rand if you're choosing a single KwaZulu Natal meeting. If you're choosing a calendar week, where sometimes there are up to four KwaZulu Natal meetings, uh, mostly three though, then that option is 150 Rand and then a full calendar month. Um, and you're probably getting between 10 and 12 meetings there, or maybe even more at some times, 500 Rand for that. The banking details are on the screen if you're looking to support the Ghost Rider. And obviously, the calendar month would be from the day that you take it to the same day the following month. Those are the banking details on your screen there. Get in touch with the Ghost Rider for his private tipping service. That's racing today on this Monday, the 17th of October. Enjoy it out at the Gravel Polytrack. Tomorrow, we're down in the Eastern Cape. Again, we were racing there last Tuesday. It's a turf meeting out at Fairview. So I'll be chatting to Nino Podesta tonight and then to MX tomorrow morning. Looking forward to doing that. And from the Clock in the Gallop team, have a great racing week. And once again, thanks for the huge amount of support yesterday afternoon at Gravel. And thanks for those that came up to me during the course of the day 
to say how's it from myself and the rest of the team until tomorrow. Bye-bye.